Hello, I'm Teresa Barrington. I'm the pastor at the First Christian Church of Windsor. And I want to welcome you to our online service for April 19th, 2020. You know, I've been thinking a lot of things this week, and I'm sure you have been too, as things kind of stretch out and go a lot longer than we ever thought they would. But I just want to, again, bring encouragement to you today. I was thinking of Psalm 91. So I thought I'd just like to read that to you here. And then um, I have a couple of requests for you. It says in Psalm 91, He who dwells in the shelter of the Most High will rest in the shadow of the Almighty. I will say of the Lord, He is my refuge and my fortress, my God in whom I trust. Surely He will save you from the fowler's snare and from the deadly pestilence. He will cover you with his feathers, and under his wings you will find refuge. His faithfulness will be your shield and rampart. So God is God, no matter what's happening on the earth. He has set all this in motion by the power of his love, and he wants to draw near to you. No matter what's going on, he loves you, and he wants to be near to you. So take comfort in that today that he sees you, he is the God who sees, and you are not alone. But I would like to request a couple of things, and that is um, that you would pray for, especially those that are in leadership, trying to make decisions on behalf of others, trying to make the best decisions with information maybe that isn't complete. Um, also be praying for your pastors. I can say uh, for myself that it's really hard to preach to an empty church, to uh, want to be near to people when they're in the hospital. Normally I would be there and now I can't. Um, it's just, it's so hard. And I was meeting with some other pastors from town this week and they're saying the same thing. And so, um, you know, as, as shepherds and ministers of the gospel, uh, we need your prayers. We need your prayers. and. And uh, I, especially my church family, I covet those from you as we navigate these days. You can be sure that your pastor is praying for you. I, I sure am. So um, please, would you uh, be willing uh, to do that? You know, prayer makes a huge difference. Uh, today, uh, what, F-16s flew over uh, the Front Range of Colorado. Uh, in honor of the graduation at the Air Force Academy. And they flew over our town. And uh, one of the things that I, I heard was that there were people outside looking up into the sky uh, to watch those planes go over. And that is exactly what we need to be doing. We need to be uh, going on our front porches, <laughs> saying hi to people even from a distance, but looking up because that's where our answers are. So I hope you're encouraged today with our service. Uh, God bless you.